Take me to a theater near you. This video is sponsored by Anchor. Hey, welcome to my 2023 home theater update video. Come on in. So in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys the five upgrades that I've done to my home theater inside of a shed in 2023. And I'm very excited about them. I've had some really great companies send me some very cool things that I have updated my home theater with. If you didn't notice, this home theater is inside of a shed. If you haven't watched that video, I'll link that in the description below. We have really been using this theater so much. Uh, a lot of people in my original video when I posted that home theater inside of a shed video three years ago now, I had a lot of people that are just like, oh man, how many times are you really gonna use that? Well, I gotta tell you, we're in this home theater a lot. It's watching a movie, a TV show, uh, watching a, a sports game. We're huge Arizona Wildcat fans here in Tucson, Arizona. So we're always watching the away games here inside of the theater. And one of the number one things that you want to have inside of a home theater, besides the audio and the video and all that stuff's great, is a comfortable place to seat. So the first update that I'm going to show you guys here are these Valencia Theater seats. These are the Tuscany style, but there's something very, very special about these seats. These are actually custom Grupo Mostrado leather seats that Valencia Theater Seating was nice enough to have custom made for me. So I got to go onto their website and totally choose everything. I got to choose the stitching. I got to choose the color of the leather, the type of leather. This is Grupo Mostrado leather. And this leather is actually used in Ferraris and Prada and Louis Vuitton products. It's an amazing high quality premium leather. Has the ventilated leather here in the seats so our butts don't sweat which is a nice thing and then of course the custom embroidery right here in the seats as well and i really love this we've got all eight of them now totally upgraded to these Grupo Mostrado Tuscany style Valencia theater seats. I did a whole review video on these seats. I'll also link that for you guys, but I just wanna really mention these seats because this is a huge part of your home theater. Um, it's just so important to have a comfortable seating environment. So the fact that I can just totally recline in these seats, these also have memory seats so I can program them to my favorite position. I've got the, the headrest, which is really awesome to have the headrest come up and support my neck there. And these are the XL version, by the way. So this front row here are the XLs, and then the back row are the regular size. They just barely fit into my home theater here, but I was really fortunate to be able to get these XLs size on the front because I'm six foot seven, definitely a lengthy guy, and they fit me really nicely. I got that really good lumbar support in here as well. Love having the memory seats on these also. It's just really cool to have the, to be able to have the memory buttons there. So I just push one button, everything goes to the position that I want them to be in. So Valencia Theater Seating, thank you very much for supporting my channel and sending me these seats. I'll put a link down in the description for you guys. You guys are gonna get a special price on these Valencia Theater seats. So make sure you go and check out that link. They have a 3D visualizer on their website where you can actually go and totally customize to your liking and see in real time exactly what your custom seats are gonna look like. Now, one other thing I just uh, mentioned here, I've got a cool company that sent me out this Manshed LED sign. I'll link that in the description as well. Really nice of them to send that out to me. I love how bright and powerful this neon sign is for my Manshed logo. And in fact, I have it plugged into an anchor power station, the Solix C1000, and it'll stay lit for 21 days. Anchor has been a huge supporter of the Man Shed channel in 2023, so I'm really happy to give them a shout out during their 14 day holiday deals where you can get up to 50% off their very innovative and very well thought out chargers for any device that you can think of. So be sure to go over to anchor.com and check out all of the deals that they currently have going on. They've got different deals each day leading up to the 17th of December. So go check out today's deal and do not miss out on the massive savings that you guys can get right now. People get hungry sometimes, so I've upgraded 
our snack station. It used to just be a little refrigerator and a microwave, but I've totally upgraded our snack station here. And I wanna start here with the Calef Fort refrigerator. This is a 15 inch commercial grade, 100 can refrigerator that gets down to 34 degrees, which is one killer feature about this. Most of the other ones only get down to about 39 degrees. And the fact that this one goes down to 34 degrees is really awesome. I also love the sliding trays on this. The fact that you can just slide these trays out. It's getting a little empty right now because we use the theater a lot. We're in here uh, and accessing these drinks a lot. So love the different uh, lights in here. You've got a lot of different features up here. You can actually change the color of the light from off to white to blue or that warm yellow colors. And of course you can control your temperature here as well. We like keeping them super cold, super high quality. I'll put links down in the description for this 15 inch fridge. These can actually be freestanding like I have it right here or they can be built in right into a, a cabinet. They're actually perfectly sized for that. So this company really goes the extra mile to make sure that your drinks not only stay cold, but it's in a really, really good looking stainless steel finish. Just a really, really elegant look on these. So love the finish on that refrigerator. Check out this company for sure. The Califort brand is definitely well respected in the industry. Now there's a little snack station here. Definitely gotta have some snacks for your home theater time. So we've got the microwave here for our movie microwave popcorn. I know you guys have been screaming at me to get a popcorn machine, but it's just not practical in this size space that we have in here. So. Definitely loving just this simple snack station that we have here and it's really worked well for us. Um, popcorn machine would be nice, but the microwave works really well. And of course, gotta have the Marty McFly hoverboard. Two upgrades so far have really changed how we use this space between the seats and the snack station, as well as the fridge there. But I've got some more for you. So let's, let's come on down here and I'll show you a couple more upgrades that we've got. So this one is kind of a big deal for me. It's something that I'd, I'd wanted ever since I originally built the home theater. We were able to get Kaleidoscape. Stay hydrated. Definitely stay hydrated. Kaleidoscape Strato C media player. Here's what we have. So we have the Strato C media player right here. And then I've got a six terabyte server over here. So all of my Kaleidoscape movies get downloaded onto this server right here. And then the Strato C media player plays them off of here. And this system, not for the faint of heart when it comes to the price tag, it's definitely a pricey option for your media. But let me show you here on the screen really quickly, some of the options that you have here. We have the ability to now download movies directly to our server with the Kaleidoscape and they download it as uncompressed audio and uncompressed video files. A lot of the times when we were watching, even on the Ultra HD DVD player, which I have the Panasonic UB820, it still did not compare to the uncompressed audio and uncompressed video directly from the studio. And that's what you get with the Kaleidoscape. That's part of the price tag is you're paying for the licensing to be able to, to download these blockbuster movies in their original form from the studio. And that's made a huge difference in the visual, but especially in the audio quality that we're now able to experience in here and watching movies. And we just have an entire library now that we get to pull from and watch and play whatever movie we want to directly from here. Gone are the days where I have to buy DVDs, Ultra HD DVDs and collect them and have a huge uh, collection of DVD players. I don't have to put discs anymore into a DVD player. And they're all at our fingertips and it's not streaming. This is totally different than streaming because I'm actually downloading the original video file to the Kaleidoscape media server and then playing them on that Strato C media player in the highest quality possible. And they're always coming out like they just released uh, Titanic in 4K. They did an amazing job in the remaster of the Titanic 4K, by the way. Oppenheimer just released. And a lot of times we're able to access movies on the Kaleidoscape even before they're released on the uh, Blu-ray or the Ultra HD Blu-ray DVDs. In fact, uh, when Top Gun originally came out, Top Gun Maverick, we were able to get access to that movie almost two months before it was released in the Ultra HD DVD format. So Kaleidoscape, again, not an option for everybody, but if you've got the budget for it, it is 
totally worth the price that you pay and the ability just to, like literally we just sit inside and say, hey, what are we watching tonight? We'll go through the Kaleidoscape app or right here on the theater and just choose whatever movie we want. Within 10 to 15 minutes, it's downloaded to our server and we're ready to watch it. No going to the store. I just love how easy it is to access all of our movies now. So that was, to me, that in, the, in 2023, the Kaleidoscape media server and then the Valencia Theater seating custom group from Estrada Leather, eight seats that we got here was two of the biggest upgrades that we were able to achieve here in our home theater. There is one more upgrade I wanna show you guys here and that's actually over here on the door. So security is a big thing, right? I've got a lot of equipment in here. We are of course in an undisclosed location for YouTube purposes. There's a lot of stuff in here. So I wanna be really, really secure. So the Lockley Vision Elite is what I upgraded my lock to here. This is the inside part of it. Not a lot to see here on the inside. We can manually unlock it and lock it. I can also lock it and unlock it from the mobile app. But if you come on the outside over here, you'll see that I've got actually a magnetic sensor right here in the deadbolt that actually indicates I can look up and see whether or not the door is closed or not closed. And then I've got a keypad right here on the screen when it's locked, then I can access a keypad right here. And this is really cool because it actually randomizes all the numbers on the screen here. I'll give you guys a thousand dollars, literally. I'm gonna show you entering in my code right now. If you guys can guess my passcode, I'll give you a thousand bucks. So I'm gonna put my code in here for you guys and, and let me know if you guys can guess it because it randomizes these numbers in these keypads. So if I just come here and put in my code, there it goes, it unlocks. So there it unlocked it just with the keypad. But you've also got on the side over here, you've also got a fingerprint reader uh, right there. I've also got a doorbell. It's kind of nice to have a doorbell right there, a solar panel, which charges the battery inside. And then I've also got a camera right here that I can see whoever's at my home theater door wanting to come in and watch a movie. There you guys have it. There is our 2023 update, everything we've done here to our home theater. What do you guys want me to do this home theater next? Is there something else that I should change inside of this home theater? By the way, I've got actually a brand new shed conversion coming up. I'm turning a shed into an epic gym. That project is in the works right now, so definitely smash that subscribe button down below there so you guys can be the first to notified when I make that video live. I've actually built the entire shed and now I'm converting it into a very, very cool home gym. But if there's anything you guys wanna see me add to this home theater here in 2024, or if there's any companies out there that want to feature your products inside of my home theater, my contact information is down below, but comment down below, what was your favorite upgrade that I did in 2023? We'll see you guys on the next video.